Hello everyone, this is Sunny. Today I'm going to show you how to use the rapid sketch. I believe our team members have been involved in internal inspection during the last couple of weeks. And sometimes you will find an issue when you're doing the sketch. Maybe because you just simply forgot to bring your pen. And if you can get the sketch app in your iPad, that will be handy. And given that it can, it is easy to use, that it can increase the efficiency. And the benefit to use this app is that it can calculate the area automatically and immediately when you finish your sketch. All right, so let's see how to use it. Um, first of all, you have to download it from the Apple App Store. And when you download it, we now can open it. All right, this is what I've done before. Let's just delete it. Okay, um, so when we do the inspection, we always start from a point. And just, for example, you're standing at this point and you're using this laser to take a measurement. So we start from here and just make example, uh, just make example, we um measuring the double story house we start from the ground floor okay so when you take the measurement let's say six meters from the side wall so um oh yeah um the important thing and and, and the tips by using this app is you always have to remember to click this button which is a lock point so that means you are standing here you're locked to the point. All right, so let's say six meters and you're going up. So you press up wall. Now you're standing here. So let's lock it and you take the measurement again. Let's for, um, for example, you are going to this way. So you take the measurement for example, like four meters, then you're going to this way. All right. Now you press this again. That means you have already moved to here. All right. For example, you take the measurement again, and it shows you just three meters upward. So just press upward. So now you're standing here. So don't forget to press this point. This button is always very, very important. If you don't press it, let me show you what will happen. So, um, let's say six meters, go here. So if you forgot to press this point, you just say nine meters, that will, you, it will come down. So you have to go back. So this is the button to undo that will bring back to this point. So you have to do it again if you forgot to press this button. So let's for main example, this is another six meters. Six meters, go back to here. And for some cheeky house, you might find there is an angle but don't worry, this app can do the angle as well. So let's make an example like 1.2, let's say 45 degree angle, and press again, and then another two meters, downward, press again, two, All right, so another two meters back to here. All right, so if you see the wall is go straight to here as a square, then you don't need to measure again. You just press this and that. Well, then you just bring you, uh, you just finish the, the measurement. So let's say first floor, 
All right, so you will have the area automatically calculated for you. So if you see this is too big, then you can just move, move this upward. And you have your area to here. All right, first floor done. Then you can move to the upper floor. All right. So upper floor, let's say six meters. Oh, that's because I forgot to press this button. So we press this button, six meters, go upward. So five meters, go to the right. Another three meters, another two meters. So you just simply click this and that. Well, it's going to the second floor. And this one can move up. Now you have the first floor and second floor, and the areas are here. That's basically what this app doing. And if you wanna make some some notes, you can press text here. So you can simply add any text, like in series. All right, done. And this. This is simply how to use this app. And it has other advanced features, but normally we don't use it. Okay, so another important thing is after you finish, you can just email the sketch, or maybe just save it to your photo library. So let's save it. All right, now when you go back to your photo library, your sketch is here. Now you can just upload it to the iBell. It's so handy, isn't it? All right, everyone. So this is the video that I'm going to show you today. And next time I'm going to bring you another surprise features. Thanks for watching.